Hey guys, today we're going to take a look at uh, a MMON Connects system here that was provided to us by Camera Motion Research. Now, if you guys are trying to transmit video from your camera out to uh, a remote monitor, this kit right here is going to do that um, and it's going to do it with better performance, um, higher resolution, higher uh, refresh rate, um, no latency, and uh, a distance that is just incredible. And uh, for the price, when you compare it to the other systems out there, you get a really, really good value. So if you guys aren't familiar with Amimon, um, these kits right here are used in the drone industry. Now, uh, when you compare it to something like DJI's Lightbridge, DJI's Lightbridge can transmit HD, but that HD is 720 resolution. The Amimon Connects can do 1080, so it's uh, transmitting higher resolution than DJI's Lightbridge, and it can do it uh, over a thousand meters or 3,300 feet, which is 10 times more than what you're going to get with uh, something even like a Paralynx Arrow or something. And the price on that is, uh, you know, it's, it's well up there as well. So this kit right here is awesome. If you guys, again, want better performance, higher resolution, zero latency, and, uh, you know, no dropouts and crazy, crazy distance. So because it was designed for drones and for flying, that's why it's so robust. But uh, Camera Motion Research has taken this kit and has modified it so that it's easy to use with your camera. We'll take a look at that right now. Comes in a nice hard case here. And this is what the transmitter looks like, okay? So um, it looks fairly big, but it's actually pretty lightweight. Now, this is actually just the transmitter here. And what Camera Motion Research has done is they've added a battery pack mounted with a frame to the receiver, or to the transmitter, I'm sorry, um, and then gave you a couple of mounts here. So you got a quarter mount here so that you can attach it to, say, the shoe of a camera or on your cage. Now, essentially, this is just an HDMI transmitter. Um, and here's your receiver over here. So um, it could be used in drones and it could be used for cameras. Uh, again, you just have to modify the kit um, to get it to work with your cameras because it has to be powered. Um, and Camera Motion Research has done all of that for you. Now, the one thing that's different about this kit as opposed to the real high-end stuff um, is, you know, when you get to the $4,000 range, you can find some reliable video transmitting solutions, but you know, those kits are gonna include like SDI and HDMI, um, and it may even uh, transmit audio as well. Uh, on the MMON Connects, it's more affordable. So this one will be about $1,500 or so. Uh, and you know, prices are gonna change. So if you're watching this video, always check on prices because prices always change. Um, and for that price, you do get a super robust, reliable system, but it does not transmit audio and it does not transmit SDI. So this is an HDMI only. Now, most cameras like your GH4s, A7Ss, and you know, even cameras that do have SDI sometimes have HDMI output too, like you know, the FS7. So you'll be able to use a, a transmitter like this with a lot of different cameras. Um, so anyways, this is the transmitter right here, and this is the receiver. Now, as you notice, the receiver does have another battery enclosed in a frame. Uh, already mounted here. So this kit is a modified MMON Connects from Camera Motion Research. And I'll uh, have a link below this video if you guys want to look at that. Um, so we'll run through a little bit of it. Now, they've also modified here, as you can see, the power cable to the transmitter because it uses a little like JST type connector. Um, and then they've modified it to a barrel tip that connects to this battery pack. And once it's mounted on the battery pack, you just have your on-off switch on the battery and that will kick on the unit or the transmitter. Now, for the receiver here, they've also provided another 3.5, uh, I think it's 3.5 or 5.5 uh, barrel connector here. Connects to the battery on the back end and then right in here. Okay, so you have a little cable that connects from the battery to the uh, receiver here. And then again, there's a switch here. Once you turn this on, that will power on this unit. So very straightforward. From there, all we need to do is attach our HDMI cables. Um, so to get this on this camera over here, inside of this kit, we're gonna add this little shoe mount. They give this to you as well. So we just run this up over here. Now, uh, they provide you with a HDMI cable here. This is a, a micro to mini and so we're gonna attach that here. This uh, 
This HDMI cable also has a tiny little screw on the side of it so it'll lock down on this transmitter. Okay, so I've already powered on this unit. I see the lights here on the side, so that means this is powered on. Now we're going to mount the uh, receiver over to this monitor that I have back here. Um, and let me get that set up and then I'll show you what that looks like. All right, so we have it set up here. So um, there's probably gonna be a little latency that you guys see because of the frame rate on that camera, the frame rate on this camera, and the uh, refresh rate on the monitor. But um, as you can see, it's gonna transmit the video from here over there. Now the Amimon uh, Connects is a product that is used in the drone industry. They are a very big player in this space. Uh, one of the best, again, they transmit higher resolution than DJI's Lightbridge. Uh, so this is a very, very proven, robust system. Um, they have a lot of equipment out there. Now their chipset, their wireless video transmission chipset that they have is actually used in some other high-end products as well. So brand names like Teradek and I believe even uh, Paralynx Arrow, among other products. So they are uh, a key player in wireless video transmission. And uh, this kit right here, again, um, was normally used for the drone industry, but it's been modified by camera motion research so you could use it uh, for your camera system. So it's easy to mount. It's got its own battery power here. Um, it's They've got everything set up in the kit. Um, anyways, I'll end up taking this out and see how far I can get it. But honestly, I don't think I'm going to go very far. And um, because this is so robust in a, a far distance, you don't even have to be direct line of sight. This thing will even transmit through uh, several walls. So this is, again, if you're looking for very, very high resolution, high frame rate, zero latency, uh, very robust uh, wireless video, um, this is a great kit. It's kind of in between the real, real high-end pro stuff and kind of the cheaper wireless uh, video transmitting stuff. Again, no SDI input, it's HDMI only. Does not transmit audio. Um, but if you're just doing video, this is great. So if you guys want to know more information about this stuff, check it out at the blog cheesycam.com. I will have a link below this uh, video. Also check out camotionllc.com, which is camera motion research website. Again, link will be below this video.